Hey degenerates. Well, after a night's worth of running around, spotting a new doomstone that also does not like me. 90 grapes, 74 tomatoes, and uh, doing quite a lot of alchemy. How much alchemy? Well, I was level 54. Now I'm level 64. It would help to have the sound on from the beginning. And then approximately 9.15, all things alchemical opened its doors. So, we're going to go investigate with Earthwar. He wasn't much of a help picking the plants, he mostly got in the way. What? Oh, don't be like that. You want to be my friend. Let's see. Mm, you will, I promise you. Let's see. Oh, well, you like jokes. Don't like admiration. Definitely don't like coercion. Most you really like stories. Okay, I'll try to keep that in mind. That's pretty good. Not now. Set up, please. Uh, Is that so? Sure. I keep telling cute. myself it'll be worth the effort. I said you most. Excellent. Don't talk such rot. Is that so? Ah, uh, dang good. it. I salute you most impressive. Keep forgetting that I can't. Yeah, I get it. Well, you'll see soon enough. Gracious, what a, is that so? Oh, maybe you won't. Come on, can't you like me just a little bit better? Every little bit helps. That's what I, I thought. Well, prepare to like me much, much more. As we haggle, and I'm not terribly great at haggling, so we'll guess you're going to sit about there. She's got a lot of potions. I'm not going to buy a single one. However, for cheap, cheap ingredients, I will buy extensively. That's a good deal. It is. Ooh, <laughs> blood grass. Cheap. This isn't ingredient you don't find much of. You only usually find it in shops with, uh, with one or two exceptions. We'll discuss those later. But chameleon. Oh yes, chameleon. You're a fine negotiator. We will be hanging on to those and taking as many of those as we You're can get. Fine. Chameleon is not invisibility. It's partial invisibility. And unlike invisibility, shut up, you can actually do things while invisible. I mean, sure, you can, with invisibility, you can walk around, maybe loot some chests, but with uh, chameleon, well, you can do anything and it won't break out of it. If you try to hit someone while you're invisible, pop right out of it. Hit someone while they're chame chameleon and they will say, huh, must have been the wind, because they're not entirely intelligent. You'll notice I'm staying away from the more expensive ingredients right now. Mostly because we're nearly out of money. Don't worry, we will be making it all back momentarily. Ah, wow, she's got a lot of stuff. Maybe I should have been a little more discriminant. You're a fine nigga. Yeah, yeah. Tell me how fine I am. I've heard it all before. Ooh, more rat meat. Can't say no to rat meat. Ooh, this is also a rare and very valuable ingredient, but not for me. These strawberries aren't rare at all, That's but I will take them. And we're just about broke. Just enough to buy the blue gloss. Blue gloss. And not enough for these. Ugh. Oh, mistake. Tell your friends Oh well. Goodbye. And now, let us increase our alchemy even more. 
using all that stuff I just bought. Including the leftover grapes. And sure, why not? Oh no, we're not getting rid of these quite. Ooh. Light spell. Don't usually need it, but given how dim it's been in dungeons, it might not be a bad idea. Certainly don't need these or that. Unfortunately, that doesn't combine with anything that I don't want to keep a hold of, that is. I really don't like Night Eye, it, it just makes everything too purple. So. I'll use light instead of it. I still need to pick up a torch for that matter. I forgot all about it. I don't think I want to buy one though. They're pretty readily available. And if you hear horrible noises in the background, please ignore them. Jerry's alarm is going off to summon him to work. And hanging on to those. Picked up a couple of these while I was walking around. I'll have to point them out to you sometime. Show you where they grow. This is more health restorer. I'm going to keep hold of it as best I can. Um, I also found a mandrake root or two. And those I'm also hanging on to because that is your disease cure. And there's really no point in brewing it in a potion because you can just eat it. Not potatoes. That. Fine. Sorry to dilly dally. I didn't expect quite there to be quite so much in there. And while I'm at it, shield spell or potion. I'm going to want this. Another reason why I want something else I usually ignore. Summer bullet caps. And we're fairly good on anything else we can get from from them. And wow, that's a lot of poundage. Let us get rid of it. Yes. Sell. Or you won't buy price. buy from me. I should have been adjusting that up, but I forgot. Excellent. Time for serious... Uh, time for serious money making. Funnily enough, she was fine with that price, even though it was the exact same price. That seems a fair price. It just all has to do with uh, the level of the slider. Some damage fatigue. That's a fair deal. Actually, let's go down and start selling off these. Yes, I have got a lot of restore fatigue. And when you sell them large quantities of things, people like you better. Therefore, you can adjust the slider just that little bit more. It's fantastic. You need to make a better argument. That was too much though back it off a little bit. There we go. No. Like me. And happily mercantile is going up nice and steadily. That will also help the slider increase. If she goes for that, I think I'll settle for that for a while. Okay, cool. Well, that's more than I'd usually get. And just like that, we have, we went from That's 1 to 2,000 gold and above. This is why alchemy is freaking amazing. Oh, we've also got these. Alright, back to the top. Get rid of all the small quantities. Yeah, yes, I drive a hard bargain. Tell me all about it some other time. I wish I could auto sell. That's more than. 
And we're going to get rid of some of these lower tier to tech lives. I mean, I've got seven of, of the better ones. That seems a fair. This and that. And resist disease, not very useful. The restorations can be useful for the stats, but you have to lose stats in order for them to be all that useful. And I don't really want to, so. Okay, that ought to do it for a while. I mean, that's a lot of money. Hmm, wow. What am I going to do with all that money? I can't go back in the guild hall, or Earth Orb will leave me forever. And that would make me greatly sad. Also, I'm sorry that took ten minutes. I didn't exactly intend it to. Hmm. How much stuff am I carrying? I've still got weight on me? Oh, that's right, I've got those daggers. And, well, I guess all my alchemy stuff. Hmm. Wish I had some place to stash all of this. Maybe I'll go back to the Imperial City and see what kind of lodging are available. Something a little more permanent. Uh, tempting as it is, I won't go back to the market district. I don't need too much more money. Well, I don't know. Maybe they can tell me where I can find a good house. Or at least, you know, a decent one. And since I have been here, I, I felt free to not walk all that distance. People are so sad. Isn't it uncanny how I move? These people are just so ridiculous. Really? If you're training and picking locks, you're probably already pretty good at it. Hmm. Interesting. You have to keep that in mind. Office of Imperial Commerce. Hmm? Let's check this place out. Earthor, move out of the way, please. Hello there. Hello. Venincia Milicea, Office of Imperial Commerce. You've got complaints? Of course you've got complaints. Who doesn't? Look, I'm I'm sorry. I'm what listening. You need to feel a little better about yourself and your world. Therefore, to threaten you. Love. Or not. How not? Where did you get that? That's. I doubt it. Come on, you can do better That's than cute. that. I doubt it. Let's see a real smile. That's great. It's good of you to say so. Well, I guess that's the best you can do. So, um, I hear you got a house for sale. I mean, of course. All I have available right now is a hovel on the waterfront. Hovel's good. And I just happen to have 2,000 gold. Really? Then you've just become a homeowner. Here is your house key. All right. You'll find it in the waterfront district. It's not much to look at. That's OK. You may want to spruce it up a bit with some furnishings. I'd suggest talking to Sergius Verus at Three Brothers Trade Goods in the market district. Mm -hmm. Sounds like an idea. But how much cash do I have left? Not cash. Ooh, level 66, alchemy. I've got a few bucks left over. Mostly I want a place to store stuff. Mm. And I want mushrooms. Let's see. Trade goods. Oh, people are starting to notice. That's, that's good. Oh, how about that? Emperor's dead. Boo-hoo. I did not know that. Hello. Say, you look like someone who can help us out. Uh, having a bit of trouble with another merchant who uh, goes by the name of Thornier. Hmm. I've heard this mention, name mentioned before. 
What is it about Dornier? Plain and simple. I don't trust him at all. Won't even come to the merchant meetings and sets his prices so low. The other cuts everyone. Sounds if unpleasant. You want to give me a hand, go speak with Jen Seen at her good as new merchandise store. She can clue you in and maybe offer some coin. I like the sound of that. Go ahead. Oh, you like me as much as you're about to, without me paying for it. So let's pay for it. Ooh, actually. I wonder if I can sell any of this junk I've got. Like these. I have no need of these. Or those. Actually, let's haggle just a touch. Doesn't like me very much, but I can at least... Hmm. I do not need gemstones. That's a fair deal. This will also probably help with the weight too. That's a good deal. I do need my lockpicks. Wow, that's all I'm carrying that was weighing so much. Oh right, uh, I was buying things from you, wasn't I? I thought I was buying. Oh, I appreciate never mind you. Maybe you have a clue. Tertullian, Sergius, and Cicero, the three Verus brothers. I'm Sergius. How nice for you. I'm listening. Yeah, I think I like you about as I well as I'm going to like you either. Ah, but you do have goods. And let's lower the goods a little bit. Man, I can only afford one thing. Well, I'll buy some storage Another capacity. That sucks. I'd love to talk to that lady about getting a job. Dealing with her merchant problem. Huh. Seems like I'm in the neighborhood. Hello. Earthward, please don't mind Feel him. Feel free to browse, friend. It's nice to see a new shopper. I was afraid I lost any hope of new business ever since Thorinir opened um, up. I'm over here. Yeah, right there. There you go. Make it quick. You're in a foul mood. I can't tell whether. Okay. Like Don't waste your flat of Yes, yes, really. I will force you, you to like me. Funny? I do. What a dumb chip. Don't uh, waste your I accept. What I guess she's not one much story. for knock knocks. What not? That's just remarkable. That's just remarkable, I indeed. I have no choice. No, Whatever you, you will be my friend. What a great story. You think that's funny? Don't talk Wait, she such hates rot. admiration. Dang it. I accept. Don't I try to remember. What a dumb. What a great story. Well, now that you like me and fear me, tell me about so, your problems. Tertullian sent you, huh? Well then, he usually sizes up people well, so you may be just what we're looking it's for. It's not hard to see my size. But, um, yeah, tell me about your guy. I'm the chairperson for the Society of Concerned Merchants. I'm sorry, there's probably been a glare. A while back to keep a nice, fair, economic balance in town. Mm -hmm. Not every store is a member, but we're slowly trying to convince them to join. Everything was fine until Thorinir opened his shop nearby. So what's the problem? Selling all sorts of merchandise, he undercuts prices like you wouldn't believe. He doesn't always sell what we sell, but it is still a problem. So you just don't like People the competition? People who buy tend to want to spend their money there. That leaves none for us. It's getting so bad, a few of us may have to close up shop. So he's Walmart? He outright refuses to join the society or even discuss the matter. We are convinced he's up to no good. He is Walmart. What we need is for you to case his establishment and figure out where he gets his inventory. Find some proof of his wrongdoing, and let us know. We cannot do it ourselves, as he recognizes all of us. 
The job pays a fair bounty in gold when he is brought to justice. So, what if I just go up and ask him? Thanks again for your help. We had no other place to turn. Yeah, say nothing of it. Um, so, go ask his guy where he gets his stuff. Tell the others. Get gold from both of them. Sounds like an excellent plan to me. Hello. What kind of deal can I make for you today? Ooh, he already likes me. All right. Well, at least a little bit. Let's see if I can make you like me more. So you will tell me all your secrets. No, you do. I don't. That's a. Ugh. That's foul. That's vain. I just don't like knock knock around here. All right. What about my inventory? I just want to know where it comes yeah, from. Uh, that would be a trade secret. I can't divulge how I pass the great savings on to you now, can I? Just like a baker not revealing his best recipes, I must keep my sources anonymous, or every merchant in town would use them. And the problem with that is? Suffice to say, they are quite reliable and low cost. That way, you walk out with a full coin purse. Well, it doesn't sound all that bad to me. Goodbye. Hope to see you again very soon. Hmm. Well, it's clear that whatever's going on, he's not going to tell me. So, we'll just have to do a little light spying work. Because I want to know. Maybe I can get better prices on potions and stuff. But, he'll be in a shop for a while. Oh, I I'm fine, thank you. I wasn't expecting that. Meantime, let's check out the new house. It may be a little bit of a fixer-upper, but, you know, there's nothing wrong with that. Just so long as it, a it is a place to lay my head, which I can't do at the moment. And these are... There's lots of mushrooms here, and I'm not going to go about picking them all, because that would just be kind of tedious for all and sundry. Now, I've never been to the waterfront, so we just have to make our way through by the map. Woo! Wee! Imperial Palace rocks! Woo! Yay! Wee! Alright, I'm out. You guys are boring. Where's your sense of humor? probably why they locked me up in the first place. They just don't know how to laugh. I wonder what would happen if they summoned Stampy. I wonder if they'd tell him to keep his voice down. Or if they would just bash him direly in the head. Really helping old Becca. Good question. Well, kind of fancy houses around here. Rather nice. No, that's okay. I'd rather know it. Yeah? Do I have your eye? Apparently. I'm starting to attract some attention. How nice. It's about time people realized my, uh, great assets. And hey, there are more horrible noises going on. Oh, hello, horsey. Let's play. No, 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 this is not the time to play with horsey. Let's go to the new house. And please forgive the horrid, horrid noises in the background. Apparently there's no one there to deal with them. This definitely seems like a very watery area. I'm sorry, did you say something? I missed it. Oh well, couldn't have been important. Hmm, my house finding senses are tingling. Tingling, I tell you. It's telling me that this is where I must live. It's kind of small, but 
Where you go away? Oh, this isn't so bad. It's it's small, but it's cozy. Little little bear, but I've got a bed and some dressers I won't need and fire and table and some chips. I will not punch the chest. I will, however, take the shovel out of it, for I need no shovels. I do, however, want to store my blade collection here. Ah, that did help a lot. No, I'm only halfway over, bird. Well, I kind of want to take a nap, but I can't. It is forbidden. So, I'm going to instead uh, answer the phone, and I will see you later. Stupid phone. <laughs>